morning when I heard the news, I was in an emotional stage. Summit Academy football players are reacting today to news that their football coach, Rob Boudre, has been fired. I was just kind of heartbroken. It was just hard losing a leader that you look up to for so long. They are very sad. Um, they're disappointed, and I understand that. Um, but they also want to move forward. Officials at the Down River Charter School had supported Boudre even after an incident in October when he used the N-word during a pregame talk to the team. He was suspended for one game, and at a board meeting, he apologized. I should not have said the word, however, and once I said it, I thought to myself, you know what, I should never have said the word, and that's what I told my students. But now, after an investigation by the Michigan High School Athletic Association and Michigan Educational Personnel, the contractor Boudre worked for, new allegations have surfaced. That Boudre violated rules about off-season practice and talked to the players about a performance-enhancing powder called creatine. It is legal, but not supposed to be discussed with high school players. The school could face sanctions for that. We were not aware that the rules had been broken, um, but they had been broken. Boudre, who was also the athletic director, told us by phone the allegations are ridiculous and unfounded, and he's upset, though not ready for an on-camera interview. His players were, though, with their parents' permission, and said while they loved their coach, they understand why this happened. I understand that he apologized and he he said everything you need to say basically, but I guess it's still consequences and repercussions for his actions. School officials say while well, everyone tries to deal with what happened, while they wait for a final response from the Michigan High School Athletic Association, a search is underway for a new athletic director and football coach. In Romulus, I'm Cheryl Choden, 7 Action News.